Hello, I'm David Bond. And I am Wayne Foote. And I'm Bob Farrell. And the three of us are working together collaboratively to work to run for the Allegheny County School Board. We're trying to work as a team so that we can make an effective difference for the for the students and the communities and the employees of the Board of Education. One of the things that is my priority is school safety. I was a Maryland State Trooper for 28 years. I worked in school security. I taught in the classroom. I know what it's about. We need to do mock emergency drills yearly where we do full-scale drills where schools are totally involved and the teachers get to learn what to do and the law enforcement community gets to know the interior and layout of every school. I promise you that if I'm elected, we will have an SRO in every school. If I were sitting on the board now, I would certainly be looking at hiring one for each school now. The cost is not that much. It's not the cost of one child's life that we need to worry about the nickels and dimes of. The second thing that I really think that we need to talk about is the communication. The communication between the students, the employees, and the elected board. The elected board for the last so many terms has been cut out of the communication level. They say that their uh, main priority is making policy. Well, they've made a policy that excludes them from talking to the employees, from talking to each other, from talking to uh, the parents and the community at large. I would propose that we do away with some of these policies and that we modify them so that the uh, school board, the elected school board, the people that the community elected is able to go inside the schools and talk to the employees, talk to the teachers, talk to the custodians, talk to the maintenance folks and find out what the problems are so that they can make a just effort on fixing some of these problems. Uh, they have also made a, a, a policy that prohibits them from talking to parents and community members attending board meetings. I would propose to remove that completely. I propose to have a conversation with any parent or any community member that attends a board meeting. And I will not let people stand and be ignored. I think that they deserve answers. If you're going to vote for the three of us, and I can assure you that the three of us will be talking to you. We'd appreciate your vote on June 26th, and we look forward to serving you.